Got that better. What's up everybody, welcome back to the channel, I'm Evil Rabbit here on Forza Horizon 3 in my V8 powered S15 non-horizon edition. I'm here today to show you guys a couple of my favorite street sections to drift here in Forza Horizon 3. Now I'm definitely going to be going into a private lobby to get rid of the drive guitars. So before we do, we do that, we're going to have to hook up our 350mm NRG minty green and Nero chrome wheel. Get that locked on. So let's hop into a online session so that we don't have to deal with drive guitars. Alright, we're going to rip our first section here in Service Paradise. Now, like I said, a lot of these sections you guys may already know and drift, but this is just a couple of ones that I like. If I didn't have the car, we would have been good. Now, we are driving 900 degrees up rotation on our Logitech G920 wheel with our custom handbrake with our Logitech, you know, minty green narrow comb 350 millimeter wheel. I got scared. I saw cars coming. I was wondering if I was going to die. So that's like the first, uh, that's a big street section that everybody usually runs. Nothing, you know, super crazy. It's kind of a normal section. And then you can just kick it back this way. Stay on the power. In fourth gear, this car is running about 808 horsepower. Mind you down the stretch. The brake. Too much? No, not too much. We're good. Kick the power out. Lee brake grab. Come back out, back onto the street, and we're good. Let me see if we can, we're going to try entering this one in this way. Then we'll hop to the other section here in Surface Paradise that I like. If I grab, can grab the right gear, we'll be good. Going in fourth. Let you break. Then the inside. Nice power. Keep that matted in fourth. Little curb run, we're good. The other way, it's wide, probably a little wider than I should have went. There's no cars this time, so we're good. Go around the outside of him. We're good. Ooh. All right. So that's the first section in the street that I like to run here in Horizon 3. We're just getting a little, some street drifting action going on right now. Oh, boy. They didn't need that. All right, so now we're going to head to the other section that I like. i got to remember exactly where it is. And we're going to drive to it. All right, so we're heading to the second little street section I like here in Surface Paradise. I've been having a lot of fun doing some street drifting with a couple of my buddies on here. We were doing a little bit of a, you know, chase the leader, follow the leader, you know, drifting through the streets. We did have traffic turned off though. Whoa, I saw that car. Probably not completely red. Oh, I believe we have cosmetic on. I believe we do. Yeah, we're going to turn that off. Prepare my car. Thank you. I don't want a wrecked car. All right. Now, this section is another section that probably a lot of you guys run. There's a lot of fun street sections in here. Been definitely trying to find more interesting sections to drift because not trying to make Horizon 3 boring because it's not. It's still a lot of fun for me. So we're going to go around this section here. I don't need that dot anymore I feel like we, we we got to it just get rid of the dot thank you all right now that we're in somebody's wall all right so this section is a little bit different we're gonna be going through a uh, building shoot see if we can get it right first try throw it in this is wide a little bit shallower than I wanted to hold it out there kick it back try to get right where we want to go there we go. The table tap. We break this back out. Ooh. Pull tap. Pull this out here. 
away from that car, kick it back. Ooh, the break on that one. Just body, body weight throw. Throw that thing out as wide as we can. We're back to where we started. See if we can't just keep this thing going right here. Laundry away from the car. Let's throw this section one more time. Oh. Long e-brake grab because we kind of hit that car. Get off the curb. Go around this BMW. I'm going to miss that. Yep, I saw that car. We're going to miss it. So there's a lot of fun sections that to be had here in Surface Paradise. And there's plenty of sections elsewhere on the map. Ooh. Just tap that. Oh, incoming BMW. We're good. Like this little area right here. Try not to hit the wall. Oh. Take this this way. Line up of cars. We're gonna go this way. Put the tap on those. They don't need those. Get back. Just tearing through the streets here of Surfers Paradise. Curve pop, we're good. All right, so I think it's time we head to another section that I like. And we're probably gonna drive there. Um, Maybe we should fast travel. Yep, definitely thinking we should fast travel because there's two sections over here that I wanna run. So, well, we could probably drive to this one. Where are you? There you are. We're gonna drive this one. It's gonna take us through a roundabout. You know we're gonna have to tear through that roundabout. So, this street section is a little bit longer. Uh, it's got some high speeds. It's got a pretty nice jump drift to it. Uh, a couple of me and the team did this in a, a prior video on how to, you know, how long would tires last on sim damage. They didn't last very long, that's for sure. Not on 1,000 horsepower cars. Oh, that was more than just a tap. This uh, Sylvia is not a Horizon Edition, but it does get plenty of angle when I need it. It seems like it can hold its own angle, which is very surprising for a non-Horizon Edition car. Hard on the brace. A little clutch kick. Uh, I keep the wheel spin going. All right. Bad time to have an itchy nose, but we're good. I am still thinking I am in, you know, the stage driving on the wrong side of the road. Now you know we're gonna have to rip this roundabout once or twice. It's like a tradi- oh, wrong gear. It's like a tradition here in Forza to rip roundabouts, especially if you're big into drifting. I'm having shifter issues. There we go. Now, you could so cheat in this roundabout and just keep getting drift points and get a huge drift total. But we're gonna end this here with a wall tap to kill our points. Just roast the tires on the clutch kick and forth. There we go. So I've been having a lot of fun doing a lot of street drifting, like I said before. There's some uh, big things coming to the channel here very soon, so make sure you guys stay tuned to the channel. Make sure you tap that like button, subscribe to the channel. Like I said, there's some big things coming to the channel here very soon. Not to give anything away. We also got the EVL Pro Drift Championship coming here as well. Very soon. All right, we're going to rip this street section now. Coming here in fourth gear. Really early e-brake initiation. Get back. There we go. Right on tickling that grass's edge. Uh, it was more than just the edge, but we're still going. This car definitely loves fourth and third. Oh, I thought we were going to hit them. There's a little jump drift section. Didn't have enough speed. Oh, the car flicked way harder than I thought. It did get off the ground. So it was kind of a jump spin out. Not really a jump drift. But it was a jump spin out. 
This thing just blows the tires loose in fourth. Hold on to third. We finish this little section out. One little quick Manji cars. Uh, we're gonna straighten that out. Ow. All right, we're gonna run this one more time. See if we can't get a better run here. Not as early of an initiation. Way wrong timing, but it's okay. You know, I'm not perfect by any means. Excuse me, you're in the way. Still having fun getting sideways, though. Throw us a little bit wider. There we go. There we go. Ooh. Got that better. Always traffic here. I always cut it way too short. Scared to hit the traffic. Gonna mind you in between these guys. Thank you. Let's look back. There we go. On that outside. Ooh, and it's gonna rain. So that's the perfect time to fast travel to the next section, which is actually in Byron Bay. Now, this section. Pay close attention to it, especially if you guys are going to be wanting to compete in the EVL Pro Championship. This section will be in it in one of the rounds. So, found it. We will glitch out traffic in order to drift this section, you know, in a competition style. And it's completely pouring. We're going to flip it around here. It's raining bad. All right. So we're going to do this in the wet. Start here. We're going to initiate at that yellow crossing sign. Hopefully we don't hit this car. Oh, all this rain. We're going to try to stay on the outside of that line. Take it back. Try to stay out of the grass. To get back that way. This wet weather is not working out too well for me right now so that's a little sweet little section a little short and sweet we're gonna go back to it hopefully it stops raining but it wouldn't be horizon 3 if it wasn't raining so like i said guys you know you can follow me on facebook twitch twitter and instagram all of which are found in the description box below stay tuned to the channel there's some big things coming to the channel here shortly as well as a drift event and a car show that I will be going to here this weekend. So stay tuned to the channel for footage from that car show and drift event. Getting a little IRL drifting going on. Why am I in first? Should be in third. There we go. Like I said, we want to stay on the outside of that line. Take it back. Starting to dry up a little bit. Go. Nice and tight on there. Come on out. Garbage can tap. They didn't need that. We're good. We're just gonna Ebizu this. There we go. A little Ebizu style for you in this section. Alright, now let's drive. Let's see if we can get a good run up. Of course, there's gonna be a car in our way. Go around the car, though. Back, there we go. Just banging red line in third gear right now. Probably should have been in fourth, but we're good. So, those are a couple of the street sections that I like drifting, they're a lot of fun. Um, there's another little roundabout here, but like I said, I wanted to just do some street drifting for you guys, you know, have a little fun in the street. Gonna have uh. Some more content coming out this week. Maybe going to be hopping on a Seto and uh, Forza Motorsport 6. Been uh, getting the itch to actually do some racing. So if you guys want to see Forza Motorsport 6, don't forget to comment that down below because I will be possibly doing some racing on Forza 6. So until next time, guys, you know you can follow me on Facebook, Twitch, Twitter, and Instagram. All of which are found in the description box below. I'd like to thank you guys for watching. I'm going to rip this section one more time, see if I can't get it right here we go there's no cars enter in there we go 
Down the outside of this line. There we go. Could have gone a little more sideways, a little touch. Stay out of the grass. That's good. Oh, there's cars. We didn't hit them, though. So, until next time, guys, I think thank you guys for watching. I'm Evil Rabbit, and I'm out.